Now one of the country's uh, biggest uh, townships alongside Soweto, Tembisa and Katle Hongho is excited, enthralled, entertained and all about to elevate, We're about to blow the roof off now. Come forth Usutu and Abafana Bestende. The Zulu Kingdom awaits combat for the Derby Day crown. As we reload our clip and get ready for rapid fire, courtesy of Lamontville's Golden Arrows and Durban's Amazulu. Oh, there's an attempt today. Don't know if there was a cross or what, but Nsundwana. And for two to see the ball fell to him after the ball ricocheted off the crossbar. And uh, I was just able to hit it back straight to Sherwin Naika. Now Nduan looks to return in kind. A bit of that skill. The player slipping a bit. Nduan now takes a dive. What does the referee say? Penalty! Now, the question is, was the contact a sufficient contact that warranted a penalty? You think that was a dive? No, that's a proper penalty. That's a proper penalty yeah. because he just dived. You don't commit to such sort of tackles. Stay, Stay on, on your, your feet. feet. Yeah, to do the Sibiria. Up against the pendulum Shamini. Sibiria! Slots it in. That's how easy it is. Seven minutes on the clock. And as a number seven, Tutuzo Sibiria, Chelsea number seven. He says, We are taking you to heaven. If you're a Golden Arrows fan anyway. Amazulu under pressure. Golden Arrows looking to pile more pressure on them. And flooding numbers forward ever so impressively. That instance, it was as Pamanda Sabelo. Oh, ball know. comes in, and from that, it's quickly as uh, you blink. The Golden Arrows have doubled uh, the tally. Momentum shift. Sandy Lokumalo with the second. Arrows running rampant. Numbers in the box flooding forward. As that man, Ndwandre with the third. Oh man, it is raining goals here at Kings Valentini Stadium. Not once, not twice, but three times lightning has struck Amazulu. I tell you what the problem is. Exactly what I was talking about to say, you can tell from the midfielders that they're just ready to have a party. But then you have the business approach of Golden Arrows. Swift play. No oh, header from up. Soon one. No, was so improvised there from Mutsundwana. It looked like he was uh, couldn't do much with that header, but somehow he was able to arch his back and arch his neck and use those uh, neck muscles. Swung in again goal and again. Four. They've let in another goal of Amazulu. It's raining goals here. At Kings Valentini Stadium, that's a fourth. And perhaps with that, that's that. In the case of Derby. What a pass. What a find. What a miss. There was a Spamanda Sabelo. Lovely pass from Tutuzo Sibia. Spamanda Sabelo couldn't add well. Finishing touch. What a pass. This game has uh, sort of fell into the pattern that I thought it would. As I tried to squeeze in Dube, he does get in the back door. Dube puts it on the plate. Fikisolo puts it in the back of the net. It's Chesan Palmer. It's five for Golden Arrows. Business like, as they said. The Kafu of Golden Arrows. We talk about the crosses, the work ethic that he's got. He tends to create another one, and the goalkeeper is beaten. Andy Lefigizolo with a, an easy tap. He had to time his run. Golden Arrows, as uh, they set their sights on Amazulu, and once they did, they kept hitting the target over and over and over. Well, for Amazulu, it's been a harsh, hard old lesson for Usutu. At the end of the day, in the case of Derby, there was only one winner, Golden Arrows, issuing out a take five to Amazulu. And then it's 5-0 at full time.